Our mission on this trip was threefold. One, to love the kids at Love A Lot, to also love them by helping to complete uh, our stage of the building project at their new home, uh, which was cutting uh, grooves in the wall, the cement wall, uh, for the electrical conduits to be laid. And then thirdly, to love the people in Ghana that God brought us to, we were able to minister to several different churches, three different churches in particular, and uh, many people uh, that we ran into on the streets. We went out and did uh, some evangelism um, in a town called Adante, and it was just remarkable how we saw God move. We saw healings occur. Uh, we saw restoration occur. Uh, we saw miracles happen, and it was absolutely an amazing journey. Uh, being a part of this has marked all of our lives. Uh, just powerful, powerful encounters with God. One thing in particular that hit us right away when we arrived was we came with the intention of loving the people of Ghana and loving the kids. And as it turned out, we received just as much love from them as we poured back into them. Uh, it was like a mutual exchange of treasure and I'm reminded of the scripture where the Lord teaches us to store up for ourselves treasures in heaven and this trip was indeed a mutual exchange of treasure stored in, in our hearts in heaven. What an amazing journey. I'd like to share with you some of the highlights from our trip and I hope you enjoy. It's exciting.
Jesus is the king. And he is rescuing this world. We, we, we are here at the Tower of Hell. Oh my gosh. By the way, you gotta see this sign. So we're here at the Tower of Help. It's our second night. We've been uh, ministering. Weston's been preaching uh, just about uh, boldness and courage and leadership in the kingdom of God. This place has gotten set on fire tonight. We just finished doing some ministry. People were getting hit by the Holy Spirit, and healed and restored and prophesied over. Oh my gosh. And this place is now erupted with praise. You got to come in here and check it out. Oh God. 